2018-19 Autumn Cup winners, Peterborough Phantoms, Captain James Ferrara. How does that feel? Uh, absolutely amazing, absolutely amazing. Uh, there's times in the game where I thought maybe this isn't going to happen. Um, you know, it was all written for us to win it at home ice and, and everything else. But uh, yeah, a bit of a nervy second period, some good goals. Um, but you, you know what, credit to the guys, as, we, as, as we've shown so many times this year. We battled for 60 minutes, we went all the way to the end. Uh, eventually took the chance when it came. Uh, I think we had a lot of chances, especially early in the game, maybe didn't capitalise on them, uh, made the game difficult for ourselves. And obviously Sheffield are a hard working, gritty team and, and they fought all the way. But uh, uh, it's an absolute honour and a pleasure to have won it tonight on home ice. Uh, I've said before, uh, we talked after the Phantoms won the playoffs in 2015, is a long time ago. Uh, there's no man in this rink who wanted to win that trophy more than you did. Um, you, you, you fight, you give everything for the Phantoms and the fans, uh, the media team, the, the, the club appreciate what you give. Uh, weird game. No, no goals after 20 minutes. Um, the second period was crazy. Six goals in, in, in 20 minutes. Uh, I thought we'd, uh, we, we'd done enough. We took the lead. Uh, I think it was Glennie who got the goal that, get with the go-ahead goal. And then, uh, and then they came back with that yeah. lucky, opportunistic goal. What said, it, what said in the locker room at the, in between two and three coming out after a period like that? Um, well, thank you for your earlier comments. Um, to be fair, the guys were quite negative when we got off. I think we were a little bit disappointed with ourselves. Um, although our attacking play was very good, some of our defensive play wasn't. Um, we were a little bit slack on some of our assignments. And obviously, you know, I think they got a couple of lucky goals and bounces that maybe on another night wouldn't go in. But, you know, credit them. They created the outnumbered rushes and, and maybe deserve those, those goals. So, um, you know, it's credit that we took out opp our opportunities when we, when we had them. It'd be nice to go up at least a goal up at the end of the second period there. Um, if we could have took the lead and then tightened the screw a little bit, that would have been nice. And then obviously you never know what happens in the third. Um, but the guys were a bit negative because of that. Um, and obviously quite a few guys said something. Um, Weld said, said a really good, you know, couple of, a couple of lines for us. Slava came in and said the right things. You changed a few things up. Nothing major, but just a couple of, you know, line, line matchups and things like that, just to try and get us going, try and tighten, tighten up, us up defensively. And obviously it worked, you know, third period was like a traditional third period for us. We were really tight, really together, did the simple things um, and just kind of ground the result out in the end. Um, we were tired, we put a lot into the first two periods. And I think, you know, maybe on the, on the balance of play deserved to be ahead, but you've got to take your chances. And um, they did as well as us in that respect. So, um, you know, credit that what, what Slava had changed and the guys were saying the right thing. And we came out with, in a positive spirit in the end, knowing you know what's third period we, we know how to do this we know how to fight and we just got to keep things simple hockey's a game of, of momentum isn't it yep. and they they got the, the last goal of the period in the in the second and uh and and from from my perspective i thought we had to come out and almost win it again and uh norton's goal was early 48 minutes something like that and uh, i thought the defensive rear guard in the remaining 12 or, or whatever wherever was left were, was huge big big uh, contribution jordan got the uh, the man of the match beers but we, we couldn't choose the man of the match it was yeah. it was tough Good, yeah. Yeah, across the, across front to back, good performance throughout. Yeah, there was a lot of great performances tonight. Um, you know, I, J Jordan deserves it. The amount of great saves he made, especially towards the end, little rebounds here and there that he didn't kick to their skates or, or their tape, and uh, managed to keep a hold of a few things. And they were coming in hard for those rebounds and just looking to get a goal. However, in the end. Um, but there's a lot of stand-up performances. The way we shut down in third period, the way we tighten the screw, the way we just fought, and, and you know, just to get the puck out sometimes. And you can see, you know, we iced the puck a few times, but sometimes that's what it takes to calm things down, to get the puck out. It's 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 better that we maybe you know go for a 50-50 play rather than they have the puck. So uh, just, credit credit all the guys for that. Just a last word. Uh, well, I've got two two comments actually. The first would be, uh, I think that's huge in the context of the season. Yep. You, you know, I would have been um, terribly disappointed, we would have been terribly disappointed to take a defeat tonight and then have to go away to Basingstoke tomorrow. Yes, uh, we know how that feels. Yes. We've, we've played in cup finals, um, a couple of cup finals since you know we won the playoffs yeah. and we've had to take that into the yeah. next weekend and we've had lulls because of it. Um, and other teams have, have gained from that as well. So, um, just, it's, it's huge, it's huge. We really, really wanted the trophy, we've deserved it over the years. And tonight we've got it and um, we've got more to fight for. Absolutely. And one last one. You and I spoke last week about the uh, guys, the crowd being the sixth man on the ice. Right oh my tonight. God. I said that there was a roar when we were out for warm-up last week, but oh my God, tonight was amazing, wasn't it? Um, you know, the box is full, guys standing all around the rink. Um, it was it was great. Um, I'm not sure how much they could see in the first period because of the box. <laughs> I couldn't sometimes, but uh, the, the crowd were amazing. You know, credit to them. They really did help us out. And, you know, the trophy is just as much for them as it is us. Well done, James. Well done Thank to the you. Phantoms. Uh, great victory. Uh, more to come, we hope. Hopefully. Hopefully.